Hey, it's Faye from Face World Media. Welcome. Today, I'm going to talk to you about Podcastle.ai. If you haven't heard of it, but if you happen to be a podcaster, YouTuber, or content creator, you're truly missing out. This is not just another transcription service or like this fancy online high quality interview recorder. It is everything all in one podcast editing recording studio, and there is more. I'm going to grab some text from Wikipedia and I want to see how Revoice will be able to interpret and really build natural voices around that. So here you click on Revoice. Now you're greeted with its text editor right here. If you're not sure what the voices sound like, you can just click on the player button. Hey, your story deserves to be heard and I can help. Hey, your story deserves to be all right, I like Ariana, so let's go. And you can even change different voices down here if you like. But let's click on Generate. The whole thing took about five to 10 seconds. Granted, it's a short paragraph. I didn't do any editing whatsoever, but let's play and see what it sounds like. Love of wisdom, one, two, is the study of general and fundamental questions, such as those about existence, reason, knowledge, values, mind, and language. This is incredible, right? And what I'm able to do is actually go ahead and just edit, write out these references, index numbers, just like that, and you will not be able to hear them. So from here, I'm gonna click on generate again. You see, it's even faster the second time around. Now I'm gonna go to faceworld.com and grab, uh, let's see, you know, stories and of my own writing and just see how that goes. This China National Essay Contest. So I'm just gonna go and, and this is more of my own writing. I'm going to just do that and click on generate again. Let's hear it. Welcome to Short Essays by Fice World. China National Essay Contest was a true story from when I was a high school student in China. My grandfather was wicked cheap. Sorry, grandpa. The unfortunate thing, Faye, is that you are a mediocre writer. That is also pretty good. So you notice that um, they mispronounce uh, Faye's world to be Fai's world, and that is pretty common. And but the thing is, the unfortunate thing, Faye, it did recognize it correctly. But soon in the future, coming soon, my voices is a way for you to uh, basically use your own voice to train podcasts. So I really look forward to that because in addition to, you know, just using my own voice, I think there's an opportunity for us to kind of introduce new vocabularies and things like that too. The action you witnessed just now was for the feature called Revoice. It is truly insane. You can easily copy and paste any text from, let's say, Wikipedia, your blog post, from people's books and blogs, you can turn that into audio. Currently, there are already plenty of voices for you to choose from, uh, but very soon, Podcastle will enable AI voice training, which means you can use your own voice to record podcasts without actually being there and simply by importing text into the tool itself. Now, you may be wondering, if I have so many tools, why should I even pay attention to this? I don't need to sign up for anything else. Trust me, I've been in your shoes. It is so overwhelming as a content creator sometimes, no matter how much we love our work, right? Podcastle Studio would truly save you a lot of time when it comes to recording, editing, creating new content. They provide transcription as well. And the reason is they have also this feature called Magic Dust, which equalizes and balances and just cleans up the audio. For a lot of us podcasters, we record in our own studio. Sure, it may not be fancy, but we do have a professional mic. After all that planning, you find out that your guest is speaking into the build a microphone or the dog is barking in the background or you know the AC is running, there's a lot of background noise, that sort of thing. Magic Dust as a feature is able to remove that and really balance the audio so that the best quality comes through. And the nature of the recording is done, not through apps such as Skype or Zoom. It's recording locally. That means it's able to record the highest quality audio and by the time you get the audio, and you don't have to ask your guests to send it or anything because all the audio is already captured and uploaded natively from your guests' location right to the cloud service. You get separate audio tracks, you're able to edit the highest audio quality, there's a fail-proof mechanism built in. What happens if, let's say, all of a sudden, middle of the interview, there's a thunderstorm, the internet goes out, the power goes out, you're still able to capture everything you've recorded to that moment. The reason is because it's automatically saved or what we call progressive upload. It's uploading the bits and pieces while the interview is in progress. I have so much good to say about this app and I really hope you explore. 
So I'm going to select all three tracks and then Magic Dust. You see what's happening here on screen? Uploading, analyzing, setting up an equalizer. It's showing you all the things that it's doing right now. Okay, let's hear it. So this part's supposed to be super loud. Let's hear, let's hear it if it's actually better. Different location, different angle. And uh, as you can see... And remember this part, the track one is super quiet. I'm going to move this. I'm going to move this part out. So part one, two, three. Let's hear part one. It's an interview right now. And the first one, let's see. I'm not even sure which. It's definitely balanced. The volume is up now. And uh, as you can see on the screen right now, you know. The, the Batman one, it's kind of calmed down a little bit. Let's hear the final one on my Newman mic. Any audio difference comparing to the first one, which I'm just. And I think it feels in the sounds cleaner and the fact that you can balance them out is very important. I mean, there are things that are done probably not very um, visual right now and it's hard for you to analyze intellectually, but is cleaning up the background sound and it's bringing, you know, different microphones, different volumes closer to each other. If you imagine yourself as a listener right now, you're not going to go through segments where some people are really quiet and some people are super loud. By the way, that's extremely annoying for a listener especially if somebody's wearing a, uh, you know, headset or headphone, imagine that on the train driving, all of a sudden somebody is just louder or independent creators. I think this is just essential, something so easy to use. And that gives you the result. That's not just okay, doable. That is really quite good. So I highly recommend that you experiment with this. One realistic thing when it comes to exploring, purchasing a new piece of software, pricing can be a real deal breaker. But don't worry, Podcasto is significantly cheaper than all its competitors. Let me show you the price real quick. The pricing is very reasonable. In fact, you can get started and experiment so many of the features completely free of charge. And the next level up, which they call Story, it's only $11.99 a month. The next level up, which is what I have, is called Podcastle Pro. That's $23.99, and that is quite affordable. And that's what I love about this app. I had a conversation with the team, and I really enjoyed talking to them. They're really authentic, and their mission is to make podcasting as accessible as possible. Thanks so much for watching this, guys, and please let me know in the comments below if there's anything I need to go into, like Faye, demonstrate this, show us how you use it. What you can do is send me a note on how you are using it, what you like about podcasts, or what you hope that they will include in their future feature sets. If you are compelled enough to get started with Podcast completely free of charge right now, there's a link in the description. You can get started right away. Can't wait to hear your feedback. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.